hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i thought i would end the series here on my channel and you're probably wondering ma'am it was series my face trip series and you're probably wondering again you only posted one video i know and i'm ending it but i thought i would just end the series because honestly fall is coming and fall is my favorite season to do makeup seeing a face chart, i saw this and i was like you know what i need to recreate it this chart was created by milk 1422 right over here you guys can see and it looked so bomb and i was like i literally need to do this so if you guys enjoyed this face chart recreation please give this video a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and beside the subscription button there is a notification bell hit that to be notified when i post up a video which is once a week unless things happen so if you guys want to see how i got this makeup look then keep on watching I saw this face chart on Pinterest. You guys can focus on that. Look at that. Now, like this face chart is beautiful. And I was like, I love this look. I need to recreate it. So this face chart is by at milk1422. Let's get into it because I don't want to talk no more. So, so we're gonna start off with our brows. Our brows are gonna be super simple. We're gonna keep the basics of it. For my brows, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Ebony. All right, and then to clean up underneath my eyebrow, I'm just gonna go in with my Fenty uh, Pro Filter Concealer and just clean up underneath using my Morphe 421 brush, just cleaning up the brow. So brows are done. So now we're just going to prime the lid. I'm going to use my Fenty Concealer one more time. I'm going to blend it out with my Beauty Blender. So I'm just going to go in with my Fenty Snap Shadows in the shade 3 Deep Neutrals. And I'm going to go in with uh, Nudie Booty, which is this shade right over here. And I'm just going to place this in my crease using my Morphe 441 brush. I'm just going to put this in my crease. Oh, super light. I'm going to go in with the Patrick Star MAC palette. And I'm going to go in with Swiss Chocolate, which is this shade right over here. I'm going to go in with Swiss Chocolate and apply that. I'm going to go in with my MAC Painterly Paint Pot and my Morphe M421 brush. And I'm going to cut my lid and just start. And you really want to do this slowly. You don't want to like go super fast and like mess it up. You really want to go slow. So now that my lid is cut, um, we're going to put on the shadow i'm gonna go in with my morphe 167 brush the kathleen light ColourPop zodiac palette i'm gonna go in the shade aquarius and then with my morphe 35h palette i'm gonna go into the shade ocean drive which is right over here and i'm gonna mix them together to get the blue that i want Okay, so now I'm going in with Ocean Drive. Alright guys, so that is the look. And now I'm going to go in with my Morphe M21 brush. And I'm going to go into the shade The Virgo from the ColourPop Kathleen Lights color. And I'm just going to deepen up the outer corner here. I'm going to slowly press it. Don't want too much. Just bring that into the crease a bit. Okay, so I'm gonna do the other eye off camera and then I will be back. Okay, so 
I've done the eyeshadow and I've done my wing liner on this eye so I can show you guys this eye and what I did so I'm going in with the rare beauty perfect strokes matte liquid liner and I'm literally creating the thinnest line from inner to outer corner and then I'm making my wing kind of thick The eyeshadow is basically finished. So now we're just going to go into primer. So I'm going to go in with my Milk Makeup Hydro Coat Primer. So for concealer, I'm going to go in with the Pat McGrath Skin Fetish Sublime Perfection Concealer in the shade D30. I'm just going to apply this underneath my eyes. And then now I'm going to go in with my Uma Beauty Double Take Sculpt and Strobe Stick in the shade Pearl Black. And I'm going to go in with the deeper shade and I'm going to green contour my face. So I'm just going to blend out my concealer with my Beauty Blender. To blend my contour, I'm going to be using my Morphe R14. Just blend this up. So now that I've concealed and contoured my face. For foundation, I'm going to go in with the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Full Coverage Foundation in Deep Cool and do a pump and a half and just apply this to anywhere. I didn't apply things in between just to mesh this. You can also put it over your contour, but. So foundation is on and I'm just going to highlight the center of my face just a tad bit, not too much. Alright, you guys can see foundation is on. It looks good. So now I'm going in with my Huda Beauty Loose Easy Bake Loose Second Powder, a Cinnabon. And I'm just going to use that to set underneath the eyes here and bake a bit. Alright, my face is a bacon. So while it's baking, I'm going to bronze up my skin. I'm using the Fenty Beauty Mocha Mommy Bronzer. I already know the drill. I'm gonna bronze up my face to set my contour in place. So it's like bronze and contour at the same time. Going in with my E3 brush. So I'm done baking. I'm gonna go in with my Morphe 536 brush and just knock off all the extra powder and press in the rest. All right, so my liner is done. I did the inner corner. You guys know my inner corner is never the greatest, never the greatest. I'm gonna go in with my Urban Decay 24-7 gel pencil and deepen that up. I'm gonna smudge it on my lower lash line as well. And then just going back into my Morphe 321 brush and the shade Virgo. I'm just gonna round out my lower lash line. So now I'm just going to pop on my lashes. I'm going in with my Maybelline Last Sensational Luscious Mascara. Put one coat on there because I am going to put on lashes. I'm really going to apply a lot of lower lash mascara. So for lashes, I'm going to be using the RD Beauty Lashes in LAX. So 
I'm gonna pop that on and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so lashes are on. I was actually gonna double up my lashes, but I feel like it looks good the way it is. Okay, so we are almost done. There is no blush or highlights. There is highlight, but it's like specifically down the face. So I'm going to do that. I'm going in with the Colored Rain Focal Point Glow Lighter in Selfie. I'm gonna take on a small brush. I'm going to end with my Morphe M506 brush and literally hitting the bridge of the nose here. Now to the lips, the final touch. So the lip is like a dark burgundy red and ironically, I don't have that color anymore. So I'm going in with the MAC Brick Lip Liner to line my lip. My lip was lined with brick, and I'm first going to go in with the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in Copenhagen. I mean, this works too, but I'm going to go in with my Morphe Mega Matte Lipstick in Dominate. Okay. And all that's left is the Beauty Mark. Here, so I'm taking my eyeliner, the eyeliner. Okay guys, so I went back in with, oh my god, what color is this? The Dose of Color Desi X Katie Liquid Lipstick, and I don't even remember what shade this is. And I tapped it right on top of the red, and we have our deep red. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, please give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye! Thank you.